Hello and greetings, my fellow Long Darkians, and welcome back to our playthrough of the Tales from the Signal Void. Uh, part one, I do believe there are going to be three tales in this. So today we're covering this is a narrative survival uh, in the survival mode. We do have some objectives. Our last time we did go out to uh, Pleasant Valley, we got Bunker Beta. Now we're going to be heading to Mountain Town. And uh, it's going to be a little bit of backtracking, but it will actually be faster... Uh, then if we just, uh, let's say, we went to Forlorn Muskeg, Bleak Inlet, then we go to that, and then we have to make a very long track all the way back. So this is going to seem uh, slightly better. Alright. I think I did grab about anything I can carry because I am slightly over. Oh, uh, Stalker, there's so much loot. Alright, well, let's get going. I'm just going to close that door. I'm going to try to close the door. There we go. I just filled up the lantern. It's a little bit early. We're going to get going. We also did discuss... Uh, we also showed one of the bunkers off in uh, Mystery Lake. And it was so full. So much so. We left the majority of it there. We just cannot carry it all. Apologize. It's a little dark. But I think it's best if we make good time. Probably rifle better just because don't accidentally have it go off in my hand. I think we just follow the river. Don't we get the road. It is a pretty heavy fog. Tempted to eat it. I know. It's tough when you're so full. There'd be a dead wolf around here as well. It tells on that side as well. And they are thinking about bringing this to Interloper, so I probably will do something. But we'll just do it on our current Interloper run if they do bring it. Uh, they had talked about it. And to me, it seems like it was kind of weird anyway, because half of the stuff, like the fuses, their transmitters in there. It's You can sort out the rewards and balances and stuff, but you already kind of got it half there. Just finish it. Uh, but hopefully soon. There are a couple mods that actually do bring that into Interloper. But they're not 100% quite right. I'd rather just, uh, hopefully they bring that into vanilla version for everybody. And no word yet on uh, Nintendo Switch. It seems, uh, not good, I, I feel. Now that we're gonna, they're gonna bring news maybe mid-April. And that doesn't sound good. To me, but okay, all right. I've at least got some visibility back. Now Chester might be somewhere out here. I'm gonna have to worry about right now. Well, are we only negative three? Very nice. Really do need to drop some weight. Oh. That means I don't have to pick up anything else because we, we have... It's, it's a lot of food. We're hoarding right now, Well, Alright, do you see the power line over there? I rest up when we get to the dam, but I think I'm going to keep pushing. I might even start coughing up. We're about, I do believe, five days into this. Now, I think you probably do it uh, pretty fast, especially if you coffee up. So, doing it out on Interloper, if you started that and just tried to speed run it, it'd be interesting because that kind of uh, puts you in a random spawn, so you could be anywhere. 
So travel might be a bit of an issue. Take some decent time. I don't want to run quite yet. And about eight days, uh, Long Dark. I think it's the 16th. Yeah, Long Dark is leaving the Xbox Game Pass. But I do believe they will have some kind of discounts mid-April, I see. So I think I believe the discounts when it goes off of uh, the Game Pass, they'll be probably running some deals. So if you do a Long Dark and you're waiting on the DLC to be a little bit cheaper, that might uh, deal the deal for you. I own the Long Dark and every platform, I'm probably just going to cover it on PC, though. I really don't want to buy expansion pass for every console. I do have like how this game runs on the Steam Deck. It runs pretty well. Oh, very nice. It runs on the Switch, but graphically, it's yeah, it's a downgrade. Uh, let's go a little bit farther. Oh, no, we'll head this way. It's fine. It's still only negative three. That's the firewood. Oh, lack of firewood. But 43... Wow. Like, what are we... I don't even have that much food. And you don't have... Yeah, I should be more careful. <laughs> Just realize, you should be a lot more careful, Will. It's probably all the guns, too. And we do have a few guns on us. And fuses and wires. And there is a bunker in Pleasant Valley. I do know where it is, but it's kind of in the opposite direction of where we'll be going. I've been wanting to hunt for Valley too, but I haven't taken any time. Uh, other than the one that's in the story here. That is always a bad time. Ah, uh, why? Why, Astrid, why? I can't exactly climb up the rope, yeah. Hi there. Well, we'll just kind of shimmy along the side, see if we can get away with it. If I killed a bear during the series... I probably feel bad enough I would probably harvest it. Because, well, you know, wasting a wolf now and again, not too bad. Especially when you're very later in a run. I wouldn't even bat an eye on it anymore. It's not often worth getting a fire going. Okay, actually, you're going about your day, and that's good. We're just both going about our business, and everything's okay. I found this also very weird. You can go up this hill, but Will can't go up things far or less steep than this, and it's it's always a little bit confusing. We'll just make a straight run. We are going to go to Mountain Town next. That should be pretty easy to do, because once you get into Hush River Valley, the bunkers actually... Ow! God, that noise has gotten worse. So they redid that before. And it's even... It's like, I think they were actually breaking ankles. Because like, that, that's uh, Jennifer Hale's voice. I just wonder if they broke her ankle. Like, 
How does this feel? Ah! No. All right. Today is a pretty good day. We make sure make some pretty good time. I could pick up some coal in that cave as well. Yeah, I'm not going to worry too much about it. Well, for Mountain Town, we are going to have to go in under, though. I'm going to have to leave some stuff at the farmstead, I think. Not a terrible idea. Start veering to the left here. About half cold almost. Yeah, we'll. We make some pretty decent time today. Side. Let's check and see how many fuses. I think I have enough fuses. Probably for the rest of the playthrough. Wires, maybe. You'll get a couple. There's a couple other different locations we can cover where you can get some. very soon here. Actually, perfect target. Wow. I often find if I'm often rambling and I'm just talking and I'm not paying attention, my fingers actually do auto-go wherever I'm supposed to be going. Ah, oh, it's amazing. Hey, that's long hours, long hours of playtime. Starting to pick up. That part of the trip pretty uneventful. I feel that going this different way to do this will actually be quite a bit faster. Once we finish Bleak Inlet, Fortland Muskeg, and then we're just a couple maps away. Rather than when I ended, I usually went to Pleasant Valley last, and then you have to go all the way back. Dump some stuff at the farmstead. Or no, trappers. I am wondering, am I going to have to go over to the, the old farmstead out there? I've got enough for the rest. Alright. That's your scrap metal, though. I need four more. Okay. But really, we have enough fuses and wires to complete this challenge. Down, whoop. Nice.
Trying to make it as good a time as we can. Oh, maybe a few sticks. I can't help it. Calories. Ah, calories doing okay as well. Another two. Ooh, are you in better condition? I could be this tempted. Stuff will come in handy. Not really. Bedroll. Cool. Grab one. I kind of feel bad for that poor purse we found. A lot of bodies out here, and sadly we, didn't, we never get to bury any of them. It was kind of just stuck there for eternity. I don't think any help is coming to the island anytime soon. The exit there. How much coffee do we have? Got about 15 cups. Hey, not the worst idea in the world. Something, something. And yeah, we'll go quick in and out on the dam. We actually did go over to the other side to check to see if Vaughn's right. We got Vaughn's rifle. Which, you know, luckily we did. Not be too much hassle getting out of here. Hey, Wolf, I think we kind of took a stab at him though. We had we had a wolf struggle when we were just leaving. He's more than likely dead though. Sometimes out here you do get two. Keep an eye out. And so far, so good. All right, keep on keeping on. We do have wolf right side. Maybe about 100 meters ahead. 
Or could be 100 yards. Not so good with the math, Astrid. All right. Might see us. Smell a census, etc. Ah, we might get away with it. Oh, we had two. We are lucky, though. At least today, anyway. There's a fire barrel inside the dam. I might just use that to get up some coffee real quick. Get drinking much coffee. Get all wired, and then we'll head out. time and that's a good sh uh, screenshot right there at some point in the uh, DLC that we'll have a photo mode we're actually gonna have to find like a camera I mean if it's on PC you can just hit F10 uh, takes a picture straight to your desktop no UI etc so probably we'll do that just show it up but won't really do that all the time So let's get across. Ooh, scrap metal, though, I won't say no. Use some more of that. Generally curious if you could hit that. No, I just. I think the rifle would carry that much, and then yeah, your your aim. I would give him a good, good scaring though. Keep them on their toes. Check the backpack. Hmm. Each is all right. Archery book. We don't have time. All right. Moving on. I think that fire barrel and then getting some coffees. Yeah, not a terrible idea. Let's get a lantern just in case, because it's a little, little dark. I'm getting pretty tired. I might be able to push on, but yeah, so let's just get coffee.
Make sure we check the, eh, at least half of this. Not everything, but we're in a bit of a hurry. Good enough. I wonder if I got the toilet water here or not. I think I probably might have, but we'll see. Use the accelerator, why not? I don't need a long fire. Get the coffee. Maybe not all five cups of coffee, but we'll just see where we're at. What do I have from that? Uh, maybe a little bit of water and then maybe some more. And then we'll get out of here. Might not be able to drink this one. Yeah, because I'm so thirsty. Got a little bit more energy. Check the toilet water just in case. Never know. That sounds a little bit like a blizzard as well. Oh no, I didn't grab it. All right, lucky me. load for much longer. Which way over? Ooh. Drop that. Get on out of here. And actually plus five right now. Oh, very nice. How long if we take only about half an hour? I think we do have another coffee. Oh yeah, we do. It's still hot. You know what? I'm gonna have it. Alright. 
And only about halfway through the day, I think, uh, you make some very good time. Link it through there. We wanna, I might cut through the back country just to change it up a bit. Actually, it might be a little quicker. I always think it's a wolf, but there's a rock straight ahead that always looks like a wolf from far away here. Oh, there we go. That's a little bit more into view. Now we'll just go left of the trailers a little bit in the clear cut trailers. Just go a little bit left and just go through all the back way. Why don't we run a little bit too? We've got a uh, use fatigue for a little while. I don't think it hurts. Imagine the second, uh, oh, the third of our content drop. The next update will probably be one of the maps, I'd imagine. Or it could be a lot of anything. There's really no clear roadmap for the DLC. So, the stuff we're going to do, uh, but could be in any order. I think Acorns were kind of on the uh, bottom end of the list. Let's see those acorn trees. Very nice looking though. I do like that. Does respawn. I'm not 100%. I, I mean, I'd probably give it a week. I definitely think after blizzards. Definitely a lot faster than the uh, cattails respawn in Ash Canyon. Don't think we'll stop for loot. Now we'll just go straight across the back way here. Time, eh, we got a little bit of time. How much water do we have? Ooh. Right, I'm not really worried about matches. Like I said, it's a limited uh, series we're doing. So we're not going to be continuing this run. I might use the same character for the next Tales. Just to keep that, uh, with that one. Because I would imagine if they do the other two tails, you would probably have to do the first one to be able to do the second and then the third. Alright, yeah, it's a sunny day. Oh yeah, what's... How much fire would do... That's how much fire... Because I haven't been wanting to pick anything up. Oh, that's fair. Hope nobody needs this anymore. Well, see, though, I'm not gonna say no. Ah, uh, yeah, let's just keep going then. It's a carry weight. Oh, wow. 
That is, that is quite a bit. I think I can get you, Will, to eat? You're, you're so fat. Astrid. I keep... <laughs> so sorry, Astrid. I apologize. Me and Will have had a long uh, working relationship, which I think might have lasted longer than your marriage. We really don't know how long they were married, though. I think it was... They did have a child. We don't know the age of the child, though. I think fairly young. I would guess 12 at the max. Because if I do remember whether there's some other picture, I think it was fairly young. We don't know the whole details on that as well. We'll definitely drop. I think we're going to drop a lot of the weight. We are going to have to carry a battery up a hill too, so... I do want to try to count for that. Luckily, we don't have to carry a battery to Hush River Valley, though. Okay, we need to get down here so I don't sprain an ankle, because I know it's going to happen sooner or later. Oh, yeah, oh, that was a wrist. You no, know, I'll take the time. Go up a little higher. I'm gonna keep going to the right there. I'm gonna wind up in the clear cut. Beautiful music stinger. And 12 degrees. Wow. That's pretty good. That is so warm. Like, when it gets so warm in here, it's gonna... It's, that was gonna start melting, finally. Uh-oh. We do have some... Oak trees, which... Ooh. Would love to stop. There's a name pond over there. Some energy drink. Uh, I wouldn't say no to it. <sighs> I'm just gonna go straight down the middle. Don't get a lot of contact back here, so we should be okay. I still find it so weird that that's still under medical. But the five hour energy drink. Like, I don't think doctors would probably want you to take that anyway. I had myself a couple times when I was younger. It really doesn't wake you, it just kind of makes you like more alert. A little bit of weird.
think we might spend the night over in Trappers and I'm not fixing that one this time. No, you, you got one today. You only fix one broken limb a day. That is our rule, Astrid. Well, maybe. I don't know. I might have made that rule up. To running, this is gonna wear off sooner or later. And up that hill up ahead, we're we're pretty close. Ah, oh, there we go. It's not terrible. I thought it would energy would be a little worse. We just gotta make it over the hill. That down tree is always a good indication of where you're at. I said never running into anything. Uh, well, I kind of just jinx myself there. Let me go around to the far right. We'll totally bypass them. In theory. I've just lost sight of them a little bit. Once he keeps going the route he's going, we should be okay, though. Just over the hill will be good. The trouble. Nope, I think it moved on. I think we're all right. So experiment I want to see. A viewer told me about this and I'm going to go check it out. When we get the trappers. Okay, it's, I, I know we're just inside voice at library voice, Astrid. Come on. Getting a little close. Don't see him on that side, I think we're okay. A couple deer down in front of the farmstead, so that's a pretty good sign. That we're alright. Sleep, and then we're gonna dump a lot of gear until we get back. Probably leave the rifle too, and we'll just uh, pick it up when we leave. Okay, no shots fired. Good, good, good. Okay, and we copy it up, it'd be. Oh, and also, 
walk with this much gear. Can I, I can, we can also put up, <gasps> wait a minute, can I? This is a little per player, this is something I don't ever get to do, so. Hey, look at that. I bet you could get a couple of these racks and you could actually get all of the rifles up there. Oh, that is kind of cool. All right, I'm going to leave you up there then. Very nice. Got myself a little soda. Oh, very lovely. That note from the Kickstarter backers. Coffee. Maybe the dog food. Let's go through our inventory real quick and I'm gonna... Unload, because 41 is a... Uh, uh, maybe keep the acorns. Or you probably shouldn't be eating sketchy food if you're not gonna get your cooking up. We should probably... I didn't even know we were carrying that. Get that curing. Don't need that. I like carrying around the hockey jersey, but probably... Eh, let's not worry. Well, if you're not going to bring the hammer, don't bring the acorns, because it seems... Kind of productive in case we were gonna make coffee. Yeah, we'll drop that too. I do want my pry bar. Need that. Well, well, you're not even on the under to get up a rope yet. I am too tired to think straight. And I know. Uh. And okay, uh, flashlight again. Ooh, that's gonna bite us in the butt later. I think that would get us a bit under. I can live with that. All right. Hours and we should probably we'll be leaving fairly early. We're going for the ham. If it's gone wrong, I don't want to be right. We we'll get a good eleven. I might need to sleep a little bit more, too. Oh, all healed up. Very nice. Six days. Making decent time. We could probably push a little farther, but... And the important thing is you make it there in one piece. Are we fully rested? I know we could actually go another hour or so. leave early, but we don't want to leave too early. Get on out. Try to not loot so much. Go down our lovely little steps here. And right now we're under, so we're pretty good.
I'll have to drop even more to get the battery up the hill, but... We did pick up some scrap metal, but I'm pretty sure we'll find some along the way, or we can just go take down a shelf or something. Generally, I have found one by a car by the post office or by the bank that has had a uh, battery, so we should be good. Keep the calories flowing. Going cold just in case, but dead body. A whole lot of not in it. Let's keep going, going, going. All right, we'll just go that way at the end of the table. Astrid, I know. Oh, uh, there should be a counter for how many times I say that. I think actually our, uh, live streaming a little over run right now or just doing via the live stream on twitch and youtube is astrid as well but i just oh it's been a i'm playing will just all straight for a couple years so i oh, rather vexing i can get that out of my head we'll save those for on the way back when i get some cats though oh it is a cold morning though The stalker, a bit more forgiving, uh, temperature-wise, and how it affects you. Oh, it's, oh, it's so early, the stars are still out, wow. Moon hasn't gone down quite yet. I haven't really looked too much. I mean, I think I did look a little bit. But I probably need to make another pass for the uh, bunker out here. Probably some place I've walked past about a dozen times, I'm sure. And we just want to generally uh, I could go down the rope, I suppose. No I ooh. Don't worry, oh uh, sure we've got this. Oh ho ho, that was I didn't have that for a second, Astrid. I gotta be full disclosure. Hold are we? Okay, there is a wolf out here. Not a terrible idea. Maybe send Mr. Bunny ahead of us.
Do I think you want to go? No, 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 you keep walking. You keep walking. Reach for the sky, you filthy animal. All right. There's some loot in there. Oh, another bedroll, too. Now, we could make some improvised crampons. I really didn't want to take the time, though. We've been playing this long before crampons were things, so we know how to... when to go up a rope when we can, so we should be all right. And it's gonna take a stamina toll, I'm sure. It's only negative three now. No, it's it's getting warmer, definitely. How do you know? Looks like I survived another night. Right, is weight good? Weight is good. Be a little more careful on this one. There's no ledge to catch your breath. Yeah, our stamina on the left is going pretty fast. That's, uh... Oof. Okay. Acorns. I'm gonna try to limit myself for looting-wise. for a second, see what they have here. Blow it up, just have everything. I'm not thirsty. You don't know me, Astrid. You don't know me. All right, ooh. We're insulated boots, 82%. I think I can use this. You are 63%, so. And another revolver. Uh, dual wielding, not a thing in this game, unfortunately. Oh, and memento cash, which we really do not have time to go get. You can actually see the tower right here. We're gonna get the Grave Mothers, a dump, about everything. And we'll get, I do need some scrap metal though before we go up. Time to go look in here real quick. Uh, we don't have to pick up any more fuses or wires, I think we're good. hunger. I had two things in there or just the one? Okay. I can't try to pick anything up. See if we had any scrap metal in here for any reason. I'm nail this two in about 45 minutes. I'm not going to say no to that. Well, there's another fuse, but we have like seven fuses. And more ammunition. T 
two fuses, actually. Grab that other metal door. Another five. All right. I was thinking about dropping stuff here, but let's just drop it at Grey Mother's. I could dump it in the truck or wherever car we take the battery from, too, save a little time. Because now we are two degrees again. Let's go looking for cars. I get close to the main street as possible. And like you know, between Credit Union and the uh, Grey Mothers. I guess I would... Can... Is this the main street or... I think this, I guess, is what uh, does run through. There's only like one street in this town. Maybe two. You just had to assert your dominance. Yeah, they know now. They know. I should have got way closer. There's no way Astrid with her level 1 revolver skill was going to hit that. But, fun. Okay, no car there. Probably in this back parking lot. I don't know if there's a chance there's a battery up there or not, but... Okay, I uh, can't get in that one. So far, that's, uh... Not horrible, not horrible. I, I found definitely found a battery over here before, so... Odds are pretty good. Nope. Oh. Alright. Well. That's a little bit of a conundrum. Go down the, the side street here. There's a few more cars. Well, that one has a crumbled hood, so we can't get that open. I'm starting to worry just a little bit. Oh, that one's crumpled, too. Okay, so we are running out of cars. Oh, if I have to go back and get a car battery, this is really not going to be a good time. I'm going to severely doubt it, but... We will if we have to, I guess. It was a car battery in Signal Hill Hut, but I'm like, I'm not carrying it that far. Okay. Oh. Car battery, alright, so. Wait. Um. Up that. A bed roll. Keep at least a knife. Alright, I mean, yeah, I think we'll be okay. Let's take it. I wonder if I can drop any of this gear. Yeah, you can even still run. You're, you're doing good. We'll come back for the car. Let's make the trip up.
Now, in Fort Lord Muskeg, I do believe they have the battery there. I think we just got lucky with Pleasant Valley. There actually was a battery there. I've had it where there hasn't been one, so. There's not one in for uh, Fort Lord Muskeg. We'll have to go back to Brooklyn Railroad and find a car. Astrid up. Oh, I see the transmitter. Little race tower. I'm generally curious, was there a battery in here? No. Okay. I've never had the battery up here, so I just wanted to be sure. Okay. Let's work. Get that weight up our shoulders. Right, all hooked up. Okay, very nice. Metal parts, and I think that should be it. Brand new. All right. on dynamite all right that's for valley it is let's head down back the way we came want to grab some stuff I'll have a little nap then we'll head out to the bunker we might get in the transition cave and sleep there till night. That would be not the worst thing. I don't have to. I'm gonna go back and grab some more stuff though, because I kind of need some of it. And we do need fifth. I do need all these bullets. We went, yeah, down, halfway down here. Alright, Eagle Eye, Astrid, Eagle Eye. Was it this one? I think it was this one. Okay, just grab what you need. I really could trim down a little bit. Pose. All right, worry about the leather. Let's go. Oh, I did get rid of a little bit. All right, now leaving Milton. There are pretty, pretty great odds. After we repair the transmitter, we'll have an aurora that night. But we do want to be up there.
Guys, we are pretty tired, but we're almost there. Really, we could just rest up until nightfall and make a go of it. Then next time, just head over to uh, Orla Muskeg. We'll need to get five more scrap metal on the way there, but it shouldn't be too much of an issue. Yeah, like I said, battery should be up there. And, okay. How did you... Oh, God, that was the other one. I need to find a place to rest. Ah, uh, I know. Okay, well... I commend you for your bravery because I thought you were just going to keep going. I was like, I'm pretty sure I shot you about point blank. I'm just trying to scare him off, but I got him into charge mode. and He just wasn't listening to reason there. And normally I'd pick up these shells, but yeah. Limited series, we're just going to let it go. Pulling a sharp left right after this. I normally can always go off to the side there. I don't normally go straight through this. Almost did forget that, yeah, the trees are down. You had to kind of duck through. I'll take it. Eh, you can keep your underwear. Yeah, we can probably get a good five or six hours and we'll... And from there, then we can just sleep when we're in the bunker. Making generally good time. How many days have we really? Curious. Uh, you say eight, but it's actually seven. Uh, potato, potato. About seven. Uh, I want to maybe wager. I think it usually takes me about twelve days. Depends on how much we fiddle about. You could probably cut definitely a couple days off that. We'll get right near the entrance. Get a nice lie down. I do wonder if they manage to, uh, gonna manage to push out the tails. I've come out support, but I, I doubt we're gonna see uh, episode five in 2023. I could be wrong, but I don't think so. Uh, not with the production, the rated, the way it's been going. 
England a little bit bigger team, but they're also working on another project or two and doing this DLC and then the story mode episode. So yeah, I, I cannot foresee that happening as quickly as they intend. Don't get me wrong, could happen. Never know. All right. Um, dog food won't say no. Go with the slightly sketch, less sketchy. And I'll get some corn too. Ah, good stuff. The cans of Tidrate. See what time it is. Um, I think about six. Well, get a couple hours. It's not quite dark yet. I think it's an Aurora yet, but we'll see. I can actually about go straight to the location, I think. I don't know if we have to wait around. Like, if you know it. Oh, yeah, Aurora. Well, this one's going off, too. But we want the story. We want the story. Finding those caches is kind of cool, but. Generally, yeah, if you're doing stalker, you don't need that stuff anyway. I'm going off to our left, and it's actually not too far. Like a very quick in and out. I think so. There's one on that if we go right instead. Oh, no, no, actually. Ooh. So we're kind of here. I'm getting distracted, I know, but... No, wait. Is that right there? Or that's not a thing. Oh, I know it's around here now. It's just... It's... I would swear it's that, but... Could be... Oh, we'll just switch back, so I'm not gonna mess with that right now. Hot or cold, you know. We do have a snow shelter. And they have uh, snow shelters are fixed. I know it's kind of launched the DLC. It was slightly broken. Those are working again. That's not it. Okay. Well, that's a lot of nice stuff. It's actually, just right straight ahead. Let's just get out on this side. Rip. Getting closer.
Oh, 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 oh. Ooh. Well, at least he didn't wind up in the waterfall. Could it be the gigantic mound of snow over there? Maybe. All right, let's get in. I just realized this is kind of going to be a little bit of a longer video, but it's a little mini series, so I'm giving a little bit of leeway. Scrap metal that I need for the uh, next one. Thank you. Bunker Gamma. Fuses. Let's check real quick. Because I've got four and I've got four wires. Yeah, we've got everything we need. Here he is. Probably loot in the morning. I just want to spray paint. This is very cool here. I do like it. It's a little bit maybe smaller of the other bunkers, but definitely if you're hanging out in Hush River Valley, I usually stay that there's a cave uh, just north of here. Uh, bear comes across. It's, it's a couple deer. Very nice area. I, I would recommend it. I spent 100 days out there. Uh, easy in a row. Uh, but this is this is pretty nice. Uh, wouldn't complain. It's it's very nice. But let's get to the logs. Then we can always loot next time. The island hasn't been making our lives any easier. Hauling loads from the coast to the inland bases has been slow and costly. And people are starting to notice our operation around the airfield and mine. It's getting harder to stay under the radar. But the character of the locals, both here and far inland, seems in our favor. There aren't any helping hands. Outsiders get ignored and then forgotten. And we play the part. Okay, so mention of the mines, and I think that's what probably the next tale is going to be, along with that map. Grab metal. More wires. Session 14, Project Medical Officer interviewing Patient 7. Return to the first instance. What did you see? It was at the beach. Just pictures in my head, feelings. One of those beaches where the, the sand goes way down to the water, no drop off. I remember a, a gray day and dark water, no wind, no waves. I was alone, looking around a lot. I didn't understand what was happening. What, what do you think when you're that little? Always wondered why it was that day, that trip that stuck with me. Focus on the ending, the final frame. They lost me. Just a little kid. Okay. You'll notice various drawings around here about Rudiger's machine. I wonder if we'll get to see it. I think they did build it underground, though. I should do our due diligence and loot here real quick, though. Not gonna mess with the fuses. Since we're here. Nada. Uh... 
scrap metal. Lovely. Lantern fuel. I don't think we need to mess with it. Got the drawers real quick. This will come in handy. That's good because you keep breaking your wrists. Let's see what we got. A little bit of potable water. Won't say no. Canned ham. Mmm. Canned ham. Loading bowls a little bit. That's all right. Nice cupboards. Some soda. Check container. Non-potable water. Uh, I think we can leave that. Let's pass a couple hours there. No, no, well, you, uh, Astrid, you can have nice things. It's okay. You don't have to destroy that. That's going to be yours. Hydrate up, and we'll get as much sleep as we can. We'll get ready for next time. We'll put 11. We won't sleep that much, obviously, but we'll try. Oh, crack of dawn. Very nice. Um, but alright, ladies and gentlemen, hope you guys enjoyed. We're gonna leave off here. Uh, next time, yeah, we're gonna be making our way to Forlorn Muskeg. And then to Bleak Inlet. Uh, I'll wrap this up in another couple episodes. Alright, but I hope you guys enjoyed. Be sure to hit that like button. This help out a lot. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time.